Hello everyone, welcome back to another Tales of Rain Ravine video, the demo part two. The demo part two has just been released, so without any further ado, let's go check it out. If you haven't seen part one and you want to, we went through a lot of like basic jumping courses and you can check that out here in the corner. And without any further ado, let us go into the video then. Doo -doo -doo. Please be sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already. Okay, so here is the part two of the demo and we are just going to press E to continue and see what it's all about. Okay, tip of the day. Oh, we have a tip of a day now. My face is probably covering it, but it's, it's important to know just how far you can push a horse without overworking it. That's a nice tip. Okay, let's start riding. Let's see. Can we do free riding? Oh, did it add more? Did it add this first time jumping? I think it did. Okay, okay. We're going to try the first time jumping then, and let's just do that. What's up today? You look a little pale in the face. Wow, that's so nice. Aw, oh, nervous about jumping. You're so cute. Well, Milo has 19 years of jumping experience. You could be a sack of potatoes on there. He'll take care of you, funny boy. Take a few rounds of trot for me, please. Okay. Um, bestie, I'm not gonna lie. I kind of, I kind of forgot how. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, trot. You can trot feelily around the riding arena while I explain to you how jumping works. Remember to do a lot of turning and bending with both ring and leg to warm up those thick grandpa muscles. Uh, okay. How do you jump? Contrary to what a lot of non-equestrians think, you cannot just ask your horse to randomly jump whenever. In order to jump, your horse's needs to know and see what's in front of it. It's an animal, you know, not a Tesla with an automatic gearbox. People forget that sometimes. A horse cannot be forced to do anything it doesn't want, so you cannot aimlessly jump over like a pile of rocks or something either. Horses are not airheads. They know some- they know what things are not safe to jump over. Also, when jumping, having the correct gait is important. Most of the time, you use canter to jump. A faster paced trot can work on tiny fences, maybe, but mostly I recommend canter. You're asking me if I'd let you jump from walk today. Haha, <laughs> I'm just teasing you. You need to relax a little seriously. Milo agrees jumping from the walk is just inconvenient and more dangerous, in fact. Let's canter a bit, shall we? We're not, we can't, we're not going from a walk. We're cantering. Speed up to work in canter. There we go. I'm going to make you an exercise to do in canter. No jumps yet though. Remember to shorten or lengthen canter according to instructions. Ride carefully. If you fail even one of the checkpoints, I'll make you do it all again. Oh my gosh, it actually starts us here. I'm so happy. Oh, working canter. There we go. Long canter and long canter. What's the next one? Working canter. Okay, let's go. Working canter. Okay, short, short canter. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, my horse is messing up. My horse doesn't turn this fast now. Oh my gosh, I messed it up. Are you kidding me? Okay, you know, at this point, I am just gonna go ahead and mess up because I can't even. Oh, bad. I'm sorry, but it is. <laughs> it turned so slow and I'm even making it go zoom, zoom with my foot. It's not working. I'm... Oh, uh, how is this even possible? <laughs> oh my goodness, I'm so mad. How am I even gonna do the jumping one if I can't do this? Like, I'm trying to turn my horse. It's not working. At this point, I just give up. I'm gonna have to redo it anyways because I messed up once. My bestie, I messed up once. So I'm gonna have to redo everything. That's right. Oh no, we have to go over there too. Are you actually serious? Oh, ho, ho, my horse. Why did you run into that? I want to go out there and like see it, the open world but i don't think we're going to this episode it's kind of sad not gonna lie oh my goodness okay last checkpoint come on it's not that difficult no <laughs> this is taking so long i've probably spent like 10 minutes just doing this course so i could redo it are you actually serious right now? Okay, you know what? We're just gonna turn into it this way. I don't even care. You need to be more careful next time. Yeah, I. The, it doesn't bring me back to the beginning. Are you serious? I have to do this? Okay, we're going to do this good this time. Working canter. There we go. Long canter. That's the fastest canter, so I'm kind of concerned. No! Oh, yes, I did good. I did good. Okay, okay. The checkpoint still counts. The checkpoint still counts. Turn, my bestie. Turn. Turn. This game is so frustrating. Uh, I'm so frustrated. <laughs> 
Okay, you know what? We still have it. We still have it. <laughs> we can still do good. Short canter. There we go. Woo! Short canter. No, okay. I did working canter after that. You guys are my witness. I did short. Okay, I did short. I swear I did. I, I swear I did. I'm not starting. <laughs> How am I even gonna jump? I was so bad, please. Okay. Um... So, my horse is terrible. It's not me, guys. I swear. Okay, how? <laughs> Working canter, go! <laughs> but I kind of do like the challenge. It's like something new. Each no! No! No, are you serious? I hate everything here. I'm so bad at this. Uh, someone, bestie, come over here and help me. Uh, like, I'm all alone doing this. You need to come over here and help me do this because I cannot! This is my third time, and third time's the charm, so I- oh, This is gonna be a long video, guys. <laughs> you buckle in. Oh my goodness, you know what? Just go the opposite way. You don't even care. It's gonna make me restart anyway. <sighs> Throw me a pity bone, please. Throw me a bone, I just can't. I just can't. Working canter. We're good. Working canter. This is gonna be the one. We're gonna make it good. Long canter. Long canter. <laughs> we still got it good. And we're going to do this one good. Okay, we are still good. Short canter. Yes, bestie. We are good. Short canter. Working canter. There we go. Short canter. Whoa, so good. Okay, okay, I think this might actually be the one where we do good. Not gonna lie, I think it might be. Oh, am I actually gonna do this? I'm gonna be so accomplished if I do. Um, yes, it worked. Great job. Controlling the canter like is an essential part of show jumping. Well, I definitely proved I'm so good at that. The faster your horse canters, the higher it will jump. This is, of course, in relation to the horse's scope. Jumping from the same canter speed with Milo will result in a much smaller jump with Rose, who is a younger mare. You need to get to know each horse individually to adjust your riding to each horse. Alright, ready to try a fence for the first time. I'm gonna buy out, build you a massive fence. Use the space bar to jump. Working canter. And then we could jump. Hey, it's set to low. Perfect. Perfect. Woo! Oh my, I literally jumped. I literally jumped. I, it didn't say you had to do good at the jump. It just said you had to jump. Look, all of my footprints are still here. <laughs> oh my gosh, you could literally make like a paint artwork in the arena. That's amazing. Okay, I did it. Yes, perfect. Just lovely. That was some Olympic tier show jumping right there. Let's jump a few more cavalettis. Short canter, working canter. I'm staying at a working Working canter, I know. <laughs> Working canter. Okay, the sun is rising and it's like in my eyes. So that is just beautiful. I love that. I'll fix that after this. Okay, let me just do that. Boom. I am pro. Enough for today. I'm proud of you. Yes, maybe next time I'll, you'll be a bit more chill about this. Me? I was so chill. There's another horse I want you to try out soon. His name is Spot. He's younger and bigger than Milo, but still very beginner friendly. You'd like him a lot. Actually, I think you should ride your next lesson with Spot. When jumping, it's best that you still stick with Milo, though. Spot can be a little energetic sometimes. You can practice jumping on your free time as well. There's a board in the riding hall corner. You could build a jumping course there. Oh, that's so nice. I think I will actually jump with Spot, actually, bestie. Um, yeah, I think I'm good that way. Okay, let's select Spot. Look, it's Spot! <laughs> so cute. Okay, um, but this is not what I wanted. I, we need to do the lesson first, getting to know Spot. I like that you actually, like, get to know the horses, and they have, like, sort of personalities, if you know, like, oh, Spot is energetic when he jumps, you know, like, but beginner-friendly. Like, that is just amazing, and I don't know. I really, really like that aspect to this game. Good morning. Gotten over yesterday's scary jump lesson yet? I see you have met Spot. How does it feel up there? He's a bit bigger than Milo. Nothing to worry, though. Spot is an all-around well-behaved horse. We won't be jumping today. Al, it's best that you get to know Spot through flat work first. I have made a walk trot exercise for you. We should start from that. When you ask Spot to go forward, you're gonna notice he's a bit more reactive than Milo. But that's so cool. A bit more reactive? What? Oh my- See, they have have different personalities. It is just amazing. Okay, walk. Oh my gosh, this is a big flat exercise. Trot is actually like pretty fast, you know? It's it's kind of a good, it's a good speed. It's
that's good. Okay, try. Oh, look, Milo is. Oh, this this is not Milo. The spot. Spot so cute. I love spot. Look, and it's because he has spots. Oh my goodness. Okay, try more like spot. Ha <laughs> ha. Okay, try. Oh, these are really close. This is actually a challenge. Okay, there we go. Not as hard as that one at the beginning, though. That was painful. That was definitely a little bit painful. Okay, try. Try. I didn't. I didn't read. I didn't read well enough. Okay, and trot once more. Port. <laughs> okay, and then we're probably gonna go to the right. Okay, there we go. And then we can turn and walk. We did good on the first try, guys. Did that feel any different? How are you liking him so far? I want you to try out his canter. He has a nice smooth canter stride. Spot's canter is more controllable than Milo's too. He can go much faster and lengthen his strides further. Poor Milo barely even gallops nowadays. Oh my gosh, the horses are actually different. Like, I didn't even notice that, but they actually are. Like, it's a really small difference, but you'll notice it. You will definitely notice it once it's brought to your attention. And that's awesome. Okay, long canter. I need like a hundred percent. Short canter, short canter, short canter. Oh my goodness, we made it. We made it. Don't say that was a trot. It was not. That was correct. We did good. I knew we did good. This round was a bit harder than usual, huh? No, actually, the other one was a lot harder, bestie. Not gonna lie. <laughs> um, that's true. Here at Grunhorf Heights, we ensure that our rider's time doesn't go to waste. Your family didn't pay you to slouch around here. You're progressing fast, though. I'm serious, girl. You're much more talented than you think. Stop thinking about your family. Your focus needs to be on Spot right now. So, as I was saying earlier, Spot is more active horse than Milo, which is a good thing, essentially. We don't want our horses to be self-going rather than lazy. But with reactive horses like Spy, you also need to know how to pull the brake if needed. Sometimes you do get into situations like that. Wait till you try jumping on him. P by pulling both reins at the same time for a short moment, you can instantly stop any horse no matter the gate. Let's practice that a few times. Pull A and D at the same time to stop. Oh, okay. It's a little bit, um, it's a little bit, it's not short. You have to like, hold it for a little bit. Okay, now short canter. There we go. Stop instantly by pulling reins. Oh, hard stop. Oh my goodness. I did not know. Okay, that's how you do it. Let's try once more with the fastest gallop you can ride. Long canter. Long canter. I'm not that good at this. Whoa, spot is like ultra mega fast compared to when you stop from such a high speed, your horse kind of slides on the ground. Inside the arena, it's safe though. We use excellent footing material here. Somewhere else, it could be dangerous though. Well, it's gonna take a while until I let you leave this riding arena. We should finish. You've done a great job with Spot today. You can ride him freely now as well, but be careful, okay? You need to take things down with him. Lesson completed. Yes. Okay, I'm going to do a little bit of free ride. <gasps> We have Rose now. Small and spicy Palomino mare. Big gelding suitable for all kinds of riding. Safe gelding who's afraid of nothing. Rose! We finally have Rose. I feel accomplished. Look how beautiful Rose is. Oh my goodness. Like the coat definitely reflects a lot and I love it. The hair is kind of glitchy. It's kind of look like straw at some angles, but then cute at others. Look, oh my gosh, it's Rose. Like it's a lot faster than Milo. Not gonna, not like, not gonna lie. And look at the turn. Turning speed, so speedy. <laughs> oh, that's so speedy. Okay, let's try a course. Rose has a little bit of water. Rose has no water. Oh, sorry, Rose. Okay, how do I build a course? I need to press E. You could set a height. Let's go Ultra Omega. Okay, let's go Jumps 5. Let's see this. Ooh, can we do this? I do not think so. <laughs> okay, let's see. Okay, long canter. Rose is anxious about this obstacle. Oh my gosh, Bestie Rose is anxious. That's so... Oh, I'm sorry, Rose, my friend. You are just not as awesome as- No, just kidding. Oh my god, that is amazing. That is like- Whoa, that's so cool. Oh, the horses do have personality. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's go eat or interact. 90 centimeters with jumps five. Let's do that. Okay, long canter. Let's see, can we do this? Rose is anxious about- Look, I can even lower it by doing Q. Isn't that so cute? Okay. We're going to go at lower jumps, besties. It's fine. Let's- And, um, maybe 20 centimeters, I decided. Oh! Oh, it wasn't changing. Oh, you need- Oh, wait. Does that mean 197? <gasps> 190 centimeters was higher. Oh my goodness. This is Omega. This is Omega. How do you even do this? Okay, let's try. Rose cannot jump this high. Then why is it an option? 
Rose, bestie, why is it an option? You tell me that. Okay, let's go back then and try a course. I just wanted to see what it looks like. We're going to apply a 20 height. Oh, wait, I just realized, but it made it like go ultra fast for some reason. Look how, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh, ho, ho, look how speedy we are. This is so good. And the turns, the turns on Rose. I can't even look at that. Wait, what is that red meter on the side there? Exhausted, Rose is too tired for from jumping. Oh my goodness, this is so good. Okay, high DUI is you. Slow motion is T. There's slow motion. Wait, okay, that is so cute. I want to try a uh, jump with slow motion on. I, I, I tried to jump. It wasn't what I was expecting, but okay, let's go over here to this one then. Oh, it only lasts for a little bit. Oh, okay, let's see. Can we try a different one then? Let's go over to this orange one. Maybe we could jump slow. <gasps> Look, that is perfect. Perfect for pictures. I oh my goodness. Oh, ho, ho. I love this slow motion feature. Look how cool. Oh my, how much I've needed a slow motion feature in my life until now. This feature is amazing. And I don't even know what to say. It's amazing. Look, a music video montage. It is just okay. Switch camera. You can always let's try a jump here. Rose is too far away from the obstacle. This is so cool. Can I do slow motion? You can. You can. Oh my goodness. Yay. Look, I'm literally riding the horse in first person. Isn't that so cool? Oh my goodness. That's so cool. I love it. Okay, well, that is all I'm going to show of the game today. Let me know if you besties prefer first person like this or if I should keep it in third person just for the video and then at the end we could go first person because it is kind of dizzying. You know, it can be a little dizzy. But um, yes, that was everything included in the second demo of this game. And yeah, let me know if you want me to show you guys how you can download it or purchase it and everything like that. This is not the actual game. It is just a demo pre-release version but let me know what you think of the game so far and i love it there are a lot more features than last time and i love it so much bye everyone thank you so much for watching this video let me know if you'd like to see more i definitely would this game is amazing so far and uh yeah let me know any questions in the comments down below and i'll try to reply to them and uh yeah bye thank you so much for watching please be sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already as i post new star stable videos every single day <laughs>